Yo, subscribe to the channel. Yo, look, it's so much stuff that's going on right now, man. I, I, I'm, I'm not privy to following everything that's going on. But when I do find something of interest, of course, I'm going to talk about it. Let's talk about it. Brian Little. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Lockout Man back again with another commentary for you. That's what's up. And it's unfortunate that I had to come and tell you guys about this particular incident. That's dealing with another Uber driver, but this one has deadly consequences. Now, my girl, shout out to uh, Tasha Westside better known as Chicago BBW. She's from Chicago. She's from the Chicago land area. And as you guys already know that in the last video that I posted, I talked to an Uber driver that drives in the Chicago land area, but there's certain areas that he won't drive. Unfortunate situations with Uber drivers all over the world right now. They're being called in the situations to get their cars car carjacked or robbed. And it's a damn shame. Like, for example, there's, you know, when I was an Uber driver, there was areas that I would not drive in. Uh, if you stayed down in the 79th Street area off of Kinsman, I wouldn't come down there. You stayed off of 55th Street, uh, near Kinsman, I wouldn't come down there. I wouldn't mess with it. Wouldn't, wouldn't mess with it. Wouldn't come. Wouldn't come and pick you up. I, I, I'm sorry. I can't do it. Call me. Call call me a scaredy cat. But yeah, yeah. Call me that. You know. I. I you know. I. I was just so thankful at the time that when I did Uber, I never had to experience any situations like that. But unfortunately, it's stuff like that's going on. It is stuff like that's going on everywhere. But this is but this particular article is a shocker. It is shocking to me. This is courtesy of CNN, of course CNN. The cable news network. They get it all. They get it all. Two teen girls was charged with murder, carjacking of an Uber Eats driver in Washington, D.C. Two teenage girls has been charged with the carjacking and death of an Uber Eats driver this past week in Washington, D.C. D.C., man, Maryland. Ooh. Muhammad Anwar, 66, of Springfield, I mean, Virginia, was killed Tuesday afternoon near National Park. The Metropolitan the Police Department did say that they was on their way to the place to carjack somebody honor was working as an uber east driver two girls 13 and 15 13 and 15 their lives is over with their lives is over with it's done it's over you finish finito y'all going away for life and for what for what Y'all supposed to be at home on PlayStation 5 or some shit like that. Y'all supposed to be on the phone texting, Facebook Live and all that bullshit. 13 and 15. Come on now. What, what, what are you doing? What are you doing, ladies? Young ladies, what are you doing? They assaulted Honorar with a taser. 
while carjacking him, which led to an accident in which he was fatally injured. The girls was charged with felony murder and armed carjacking. The young, the younger girl is from Southeast Session of D.C. and the older girl is from Fort Washington, Maryland. Honorar, an immigrant of Pakistan, in 2014, he was a beloved husband, father, grandfather, uncle, and friend who always provided a smile when you needed one. Now, of course... I got the video. The video is kind of hard to watch, especially towards the end. These young ladies right here was 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 assaulting the driver. Try, you know, the the, young, the the people that was watching it all unfold. I'm not sure what I what I could say about them because of course I was not there. But it is a what would you do moment. What would you do? If you saw somebody was getting carjacked by two young ladies, I don't know. Would you would have stepped in to try to do something? Or is there something that could have been done? Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> 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 My phone is in the car. <laughs> Y'all did, did hear that, right? My phone is in the car. She was so concerned. Not not concerned about, about the guy laying on the ground. Not him. Not him. Not the guy that's laying on the ground. She's concerned about her phone in the car. Not concerned about her friend. I mean, you know, they, they literally flipped the car up sideways. How was that possible? She wasn't concerned about her friend. No, no, not that. But concerned about 
the phone that was in the car. My phone is in here. No, no, no. Hey, Come on now. Come on now. Somebody help me out with that. Somebody, somebody please help me out with that. Help me understand why she was so concerned about the phone in the car and not the and, and not the guy that was fatally injured. And they was getting, I mean, and and the and and the 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 servicemen was helping them out of the car, like, hey, you know, it's an accident right here. Let me go over here, help them out. But they didn't know what was going on. They didn't know that the young that that the that the older gentleman was being carjacked. You know, from their perspective, you know, they was probably, you know, the guy probably was like, you know, hanging on to the car and they was trying to get away. But the people that was there that witnessed it kind of came back and reiterated that, yo, they were still in that man's car. Damn shame. Damn shame. Again, their their lives is over with. For Nito. And another thing too, uh, you know, you you know your family and they 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 get the news on the news. They they watching the news like, "Hey, um Somebody was getting carjacked, and all of a sudden they get they, all of a sudden they see it was their loved one fatally injured on the street. I know that's kind of heartbroken right there, man. But again, it's 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 kind of like a what would you do moment. I mean, would would, would you guys would have intervened? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. It's sad, though, you know, to see two girls. And for what? For what? Let's see the. Um, let's go to the let's let's go to let's go to the news. The hearing running late, the story almost too horrifying to imagine. The detective says that one of the girls admitted that the two of them took the Metro here to Navy Yard with the intent of stealing a car. They encountered Muhammad Anwar, 66, not in this car, but in a Honda Accord. There was a bit of a struggle. Anwar got a hold of one of the girl's cell phones. The two girls were in the car. He was on the driver's side, trapped between the car and the driver's seat, the car door and the driver's seat. One girl says that the other girl jammed the car into gear and started swinging the wheel while Anwar, the Uber Eats driver, was trapped back there. The car hit something here. The door slammed into Anwar. Then the car spun around, took a hard right turn here on N Street, right by Nat Stadium, went up on two wheels. Anwar was thrown and crushed. And he died. At this, this, this is the state that we living in now, man. Two, two teenagers, 13 and, and the other one, 15. Two teenagers, 13 and 15. I can't, I, 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 I just can't wrap my head around it. I, I just can't. I mean... I mean, these young ladies supposed to be somewhere with their girlfriends doing girl things, not coming, not getting on a metro rail down to where they went to to steal a car. I, I don't know what to say, man. I, I really, I really don't. I, I can't, I can't right now. I really can't. <laughs> Man, listen, look, Uber guys, 
y'all be careful, man. Y'all be straight up careful. It's crazy out here. It's crazy out here. If you guys get a call and y'all feel that, if y'all feel that the place where y'all getting a call to go to and y'all not feeling it, don't go. And teenagers, come on now. Come on now, PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, uh, uh, Facebook, all of that. Come on now. Because young lady getting out of her car worrying about her cell phone is the least of her problems right now. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All right, that's going to do it for today's commentary, everybody. Y'all take it easy. Yo, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying? Hey, shout out to Keeping It 100. Yo, you see the shirt. You see the shirt. Thanks, girl. I appreciate it. I, I appreciate it. Feels comfortable and soft. I like this. Make sure y'all hit that like button on the way out the door. And, uh, and yeah, yeah. That's it. You guys take it easy. I'll come back at you with another video. Peace. Brian Little. <laughs>